All right, for the next one it says find the domain and range. Domain is your X and range is your Y. So let's go ahead and look at the domain. We're looking for the X values. So the graphs on the X axis, it starts here at negative seven and the graph continues and it ends at positive two. So it's from here to here. So the way I would write this in inequality form would be negative seven. Since it's a solid, I'm gonna make sure that I have that line because it's a solid point. Then my x, this is an open circle, so then I would not have the line. There's no line there, and it would be two. So my x values are between negative seven and two. So from here to here would be your domain because oh, there's numbers, I mean there's points along the x, the x between those two numbers. That would be your domain. Your range is your y. I'm gonna use red. So it would be from the y-axis, but we would start from the negative to the positive. So here it would start at negative eight because that's where my graph starts. And it ends at this number right here, which is zero. So here I would put negative eight, then my y, and then my zero, and then we would put my inequalities. And one of them is solid. This one would be solid because it's a solid line. And here at zero, it would also be solid because that one's solid. Even though that one's not solid, that one is. So then equals as well. Let's go ahead and do another one, domain range. Find the domain and find the range. Let's go ahead and do domain in blue as well. So my domain are my x's. So starting here on the x's, when does it start? Right here, which is at zero. And it stops right there at five from zero to five, not two. A lot of kids get that confused. That is not two. X is, X is not starting here at two, it's starting at zero. That's where the graph starts, from zero to five, between those two. So here I would put zero, X, five. I would put my inequalities. Now here at zero, it's open, so it does not have a line. But here at five, it is closed, so it should have a line to include the five. Now the range. The range is from bottom to top. So from here, it starts here, which is also zero. And the highest point is right there at four. So it would go from zero to four. And my range is your y. Now at zero, is it solid? Yes, so we need to put a solid line. At four, is it solid? Yes, so a solid line. All right, let's go ahead and do another one. Find the domain and range for this one. Domain is your x's, so it starts at, from here on your x, it starts at negative three and it goes to two. So the way I would write my domain, my domain is my x's, negative three to two, put my x here, put your inequalities. Now here at negative three, it is a solid point, so you put a solid line. At positive two, it is an open circle, so leave it alone, don't put, it, don't put a line because it's open your range. Your range is from bottom to top. Bottom right there at negative seven to top positive two. So my range is from negative seven y 
positive 2. Negative 7 is solid. Put your solid line. Positive 2 right here is solid as well. So put your line.